Alright guys, hey what's up, is Sniper 7 here, and I'm playing Cloud Ghosts, don't, don't ask me why man, I don't know, alright, it's just I felt like playing Ghosts, so, hopped on, and uh, I'm gonna see how we do, it's a live commentary, and I'm gonna try to keep this one pretty short, basically, I got a lot of things in the works right now. Um, I've got two channels uh, in addition to mine that I'm gonna be working with. First thing first, my friend Anthony at the channel So Close to Bacon. Himself and I are going to be working on a series of uh, roast type videos, you know. And we're, that's that's going to be more in the future. We haven't decided exactly how we're going to do things yet, how we're going to pick videos, exactly what kind of stuff we're going to do like that. We just decided we wanted to do roast type content. And the second thing is we also decided to start up our own gaming team, Iniquity Gaming and I'm not actually running my clan tag on this. This is from before I started up Iniquity. But I have an Iniquity gamer tag. My gamer tag for that is Iniquity X Shadow. And all I can really say is expect some cool stuff. We are currently recruiting and we're training right now to get into the COD World Leagues 2017. When the next Call of Duty comes out, we're going to hit the ground running and we're not going to stop. And hopefully, the future's bright. So, uh, let's get into this COD match. I've been trying to get into this real quick. And. I know a lot of people are going to ask me why I'm playing Ghosts. Quite frankly, I really don't know. I feel like Ghosts is a little bit easier than the other games to just do a live combat. So, I don't have to warm up as much for Ghosts. Um, I will actually end up doing some kind of video relating to... How to get really good at Black Ops 3. I think people overcomplicate Black Ops 3 a lot. And it's not hard to get good at the game. I found a few easy tips and tricks that worked for me. And they may work for you. And with that said, let's see if we can find some people to shoot at. Because apparently... There's no one here. And this has been a long time since I've done a uh, live commentary. And of course there's an IED. It's been a long time since I've done a live commentary. I've just been so busy working on edited content. And there will be an update video coming out relatively soon. Um, I'll be working on that, man. Wow. I guess Ghost isn't as easy as I thought it was, still. Uh, I'm pretty good at Ghosts. Um. For those of you who don't actually know, and I'm not sure if I've talked about this on the channel before or not. But I did actually used to participate in MLG game battles in Modern Warfare 2 on Xbox 360 under the gamer tag Xstealth Sniper 7. Now, holy crap, man! Uh, this was before I could really afford any setup for recording, and I really can't even re afford a recording setup now. The PlayStation's have got free software; it just works, and. That's all I can really say. It's just free. So, I mean, you can't beat free. I can afford free. Came with the PlayStation. And... 
Um, yeah, so back on track here. Yeah, I actually did complete an MLG game battles for Modern Warfare 2. This kid with the shotgun. Um, and I like to think I was pretty good. I'll do it, Riley. Sit down. Alright. And, um, I used snipers mostly. My team was just one of those show off -y teams that used snipers. That was the thing. Everybody was cool if they could hit some cool quick scopes or something back then. But that was back around the time before quick scoping really got big. So, that was actually back when people just ran sniper kits to run sniper kit. Oh man, man. Who's chopping? And, um. Yeah, so I actually have a background at competitive COD. Which doesn't mean much in this current scene because there's just so many players. I've never met any of the current competitive players. I think I may have gone up at one point against Nade Shot, but it was probably in friendly fun, especially since I did game battles and it's not, you know, real deal MLG and everything. Um, yeah, and the other thing is people like to think, for some reason, anybody who's ever done competitive COD is some kind of super try-hard, next level, I don't, I don't even know, man. Um, I'm one of the older, old school COD players, and I say it like that, but I'm really only, I'm turning 20 this year, man, I just, I've been playing since I was young. And I was on a GB's team when I was younger. There's nothing big, but I do have that background at competitive COD. So the, with my insight on competitive Call of Duty now, compared to how it was back then, it's just, I don't know, things seem very different. And I think there's a lot more trying to impress people going down now than... Back in the day, because back in the day it was really about having fun, getting together with some mates, and just seeing who had the better team. That was it. There wasn't any real trying to, you know, I don't know what the word is, posturing, I guess. I don't know if posturing is the word, but really trying to get your name out there wasn't a thing. Where you just, where you just competed, and if it was worth it you got your name out and my team wasn't all that amazing like i said i was shoot i can't even remember how old i was i was a kid and we were a bunch of kids and we thought we were really cool because we could snipe and we did that in every match no matter what we only sniped snipers only and Looking back on it now, it's kind of ridiculous, but... Oh, come on, mate. Um, looking back on it now, it's kind of ridiculous, but... It doesn't matter. And this uh, live comm's getting a little rambly, and that's just because it's been so long since I've done a live commentary... ...that I've got to get you back used to it. Um, alright, let's pop that. Oracle... Let's see how rusty I am with this. No, oh, he's gonna shoot me down. Ah, uh, jeez. I'm really bad at Hilo Scout now. <laughs> I used to be really good at this when I first started playing. Um.
This is not one of those things you do on a live, holy crap. <laughs> live commentary. Is sailing at a helo scout is not something you want to do on a live com, but um... That's that. 14 and 14. Mm, meh, I could have done better, but... For my first live commentary in a while. I'll take it. Uh, so after this video goes up, I will be uploading another video really soon, which is going to have gameplay highlights from across my entire spring break, and I did end up staying here in North Carolina doing nothing the whole time, so uh, thanks for watching all the way through if you did watch, and...